There's no way you can be black in London, really, I think, and not be aware of politics growing up. You see how much it starts to entrench your daily life. Uh, the movement of people, the tearing apart of communities, a uh, heavy police presence. On no symbolic level, on no abstract level, I live in a prison, man. For any given reason, they, they can stop me, take away my freedom of movement. There's been a quiet awakening happening. People aren't going to rest on just accepting injustice. There's a thirst for this kind of organization, which is young, black, revolutionary, militant. <laughs> It makes me feel this is important. Partly, I feel like things need to be said and these things need to be highlighted and brought out. And I feel like sometimes these conflicts need to happen. Yeah! Yeah! It's been incredibly hard, man. It's been arrest after arrest, police intimidation, heavy state surveillance. But I'm glad I joined, because could I be doing anything else, man? Once you see the injustice in the world, you can't do anything else but this.